The demand for skilled aviation mechanics is at an all-time high due to a nationwide labor shortage, and it's expected to continue. Luckily, the Valley has a school right in the area that specializes in preparing students for these careers. The PIA School for Aviation Maintenance will host a public aviation career exploration event later this morning. So joining me with more on what's happening today is PIA Campus Director Joseph DiRamo. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Yeah, I have to start by asking really just noting in general, this is a shortage that we've seen in other industries and across the country. But how is this kind of shortage a little bit different? What are we looking at whenever it comes to aviation mechanics and maintenance uh, across the country? Sure. We hear about the labor shortages in general, but uh, particularly so in the aviation industry. Um, Boeing recently did a study and, and that study reported about 38 percent of all aviation technicians are at the age of 60 or older. So it is an aging workforce, particularly in the field of aviation. So this seems like it would be something that would be very in demand for a younger audience, something uh, that, you know, you're looking at bringing up the next generation of these aviation mechanics. Uh, are these students getting hired right out of PIA? Is this something that the industry is looking to accomplish? Absolutely. Currently, we're reporting about a 98% placement rate within 30 days of graduating. So uh, students have uh, so many opportunities, really due to the laws of supply and demand. Uh, s demand is high right now, but the supply for new technicians is low. So the careers in aviation, whether it's pilots, maintenance technicians, or flight attendants, are all in demand right now. And because of that demand, I'm sure the salaries are also a lot higher to try and get some of these students, a lot of them, I'm sure, from our area into these positions, right? Ab absolutely. So the uh, Bureau of Labor Statistics is reporting the average salary of an aviation technician right now at a little above $70,000 a year. We're currently seeing in, in the local area anywhere from about $26 to $36 an hour starting salary. And the nice thing about some of these opportunities is that students and their family either get free or reduced flights uh, as, a, as a perk uh, being in the industry. And you're hosting this event later today, so then uh, potential students can explore their career path, see if they're interested. But for those who might already know, what should students know about enrollment? What are those deadlines coming up? And, and can you tell me a little bit about financial support that's available if needed? Absolutely. So we, we do have uh, financial aid available. Uh, students are able to apply for uh, not only federal financial aid and student loans, but also there's many grants that are out there in the aviation industry. So for us, I think students, if they were interested uh, to come out, and, and whether you're a traditional student or a non-traditional student looking for a new career, uh, today at 1030, we do have an open house event. Uh, I encourage people to be there about 1030, uh, be able to meet not only students, but instructors, and then there'll be at least some employers there as well that you can ask them questions and then maybe just see the aircraft and take a walk around the hangar. And tell me a little bit more about today's event. I, I'm sure that there's a lot of different aspects of this industry that students are going to be able to look into and uh, discover, you know, that they might not be so aware of. Tell me about what those offerings are like. Yeah, absolutely. So students uh, often, you know, look at commercial airlines as probably our primary employer. Uh, but there's a lot of industries that, 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 that recruit and, and seek out our students. Um, so corporate aircraft right now is, is, is another hot, hot topic for for us, uh, there's there's so many different employers that are dealing with corporate uh, and, and, and what they said call the ultra wealthy uh, needing private aircraft to fly. Uh, in addition to that, air cargo right now is really hot. So obviously, due to things like Amazon and, and delivery services, um, you know our students are working a lot in air cargo as well. Um, but there's a number of different industries that, that that recruit our students as well, including things that deal with uh, you know amusement park rides, forklift operators, elevator repair. Uh, all of those people are seeking our students with the skill set that we help them develop at our school. So a lot of different applications for uh, this pretty specialized training. Uh, best of luck to you at your event today, and thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. All right, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after the break.